Welcome everyone. Today we're going to be taking a look at Bus Driving Simulator 22. Um, something new has come up today. That's why I rushed to get on to this video. Uh, this is the third video actually for today. Uh, it did police, Autobahn Police Simulator 22 earlier. We got the undercover uh, vehicle going and we got Train Simulator Classic. Uh, brand new route add-on that uh, just came out so check out those videos as well but right at this moment we got an update from uh, Ovalex it's the 1.1 update on this beautiful game we're gonna check it out now so let's see what is up with the settings so graphics wise we got a good selection of resolution to select from uh, full screen, V-Sync, no, vegetation, yes. Um, maybe we should raise everything to Ultra. Just to test everything out. So visibility range, very high. Bloom, very high. Shadow quality, very high. Oh man, if this works out, this is going to look so good. Right? Back. And what other settings do we have? English, transmission, automatic. Oh, we can have manual too. I think I'll leave it on automatic just to get those golds for today. We'll try it next time. So you have UI mirrors now in the inside of the bus if you want. Virtual mirrors. That's pretty good. Very good, actually. I'm on the metric system, as you can see here. All right, that checks out. Other settings, uh, controls. All right, camera, change camera. They still, they still didn't put individual uh, views. I still want to see more camera options individualized here. So instead of change camera, we should have camera one, camera two, camera three, camera four and set up buttons for it. That would be awesome. That would be awesome. In the next update, Ovalex, please, please team, give us individual cameras, guys. And track IR, of course, I'm not gonna complain. Whenever you're ready, give us some track IR. All right, this looks good. I'm not gonna fiddle around too much with these settings. And let's check audio. Ah, oh, yes. So we have two bars now instead of one. We have a master volume and the music volume. That is cool. All right, very good. Now, what other goodies do we have? I think we have an e-bus now, guys. From what I saw in the thumbnail, in the update, we have an amazing e-bus. So let's go check it out. Where is it? There it is, electric. Although, I don't like this. I think this should say e-bus on it instead of electric. Looks too gamery, too mobile phony for me. But all the same, I'm going to select this. And we're going to take our beautiful e-bus and visit Bavaria region uh, in Europe. Population 13 million. Quite a bit. So we're almost maxed out on this. We're going to go... See if we can get a gold so let me know if you guys have already tested out this new update it's update version 1.1 it's pretty awesome all right turn our lights on actually right turn let's check out the bus first take a look from the outside all oh, the inside is pretty nice yellow flooring with blue uh, tapestry very cool. And there's our beautiful bus. Man, she is detailed. That is looking sexy. I like it. I like it a lot. Huh. Can't wait till I see modded, customized skins for this bus. All right, let's go. Oh, you can't hear the engine. Look how super quiet that sounds. Awesome. Hello, everyone. 
Hello. 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 All right, we have an electric bus in the countryside. Very cool. So far, I maxed everything out. Seems to be run on, running okay. Not getting too much lag at the moment. Wait, is he gonna crash into me? No, he's not. Okay. Whoop. He broke at the last second. Smart man. You don't want to damage this bus. It's gonna cost you quite a bit. Uh, not you, the insurance. Right, listen to that sound. It's awesome. All right, we're going to be using our cruise control as well. So I am on the Logitech G29. And uh, it's beautiful, like I said in my previous videos as well. There's a lot of uh, center torque tension on the wheel. A uh, good amount of uh, tension. Uh, I don't feel any ground feedback though no terrain rumbling or anything like that so that's still probably in their future updates but man does it feel good feels nice and heavy just like a bus should good acceleration not too fast not too slow I am using the mouse to uh, look left and right. Hopefully track IR is gonna come one day to this game. Here's our second stop. Hello. Hello. Right, here we go. So no UI, at least I'm going as much as hudless as possible as I can. All right, let's stop here. All right, it's a yield. It's not a stop sign, so we can take off. Stop signs, uh, mind stop sign guys. They need a lot of time. For your bus to stand still before you get the uh, confirmation or the XP needed. So what I'm already noticing on this electric bus is when I try to look right, I can't really see. I have a blind spot, so I can't see incoming, uh, oncoming traffic from my left side. I'm a little too back. So there's no seat adjust adjusting in this game, or no FOV, field of view, adjusting either. So maybe that's something we could look at in the future. Come on, Hello. come on, we've got a schedule to keep. See a car coming. Good time to leave. Careful I don't clip this bus. Right. Turning right here. Haven't encountered any animals crossing yet. Really fighting with a wheel. It's a lot of tension, a lot of torque. <laughs> Oh, is she gonna cross? No, he's fine. What's this trailer doing here? Abandoned in the middle of the the field. Oh, careful, careful. There's the animals. Alright, we'll just wait for them to pass. What kind of horn do we have? Not bad. 
Sounds a little unfortunate. A little sad. <laughs> a little under underwhelming. I don't know what other words I what other adjectives I could think of. But it's okay. It's not bad. It's not like the the bus is horn. In the bus, wow, they changed it now, but it was bad. It was like, wah, wah. It was very bad. Yeah, fortunately, they changed it on a couple of buses. I don't know if they kept it on all the buses, though. Hey, so far, so good. Let's see, do we have any mistakes yet? Mistake zero. We're doing good, guys. Halfway there. Hello. Hello. Also, if you haven't checked it out already, I did a Train Sim World 2 Spirit of Steam uh, Hudless Challenge on on the Loco. Beautiful video. No instruments, nothing whatsoever. Check that video out. I also did a Laskin Truck Simulator uh, No HUD Challenge as well. So, two great videos you guys have to check out with No HUDs in the game and uh, just going completely blind. I'm very proud of those two videos so far. Probably going to do some more No HUD challenges in the future. Let me know which games you'd like me to do a No HUD challenge on. And I'll probably get on them right away. Who knows? Also guys, don't forget to like, share, favorite, subscribe if you haven't done so already on this channel. We've got a lot of great content coming. Summertime is going to be hot for some people, but it's going to be even hotter on this channel. There's a lot of new games coming out, so stay tuned. Stay tuned. Not a lot of speed signs uh, on the route, so I don't know how fast I'm supposed to be going. So I'll just stay on the uh, default under 40 on this road. It is a dirt road. I mean, it is Bavaria. The countryside. Beautiful, by the way. Let's see how long we stop. 1001, 1002, 1003. Takes three seconds. See, I can't see. Well, I could. But just barely. Alright. A chance, hopefully, he's not gonna crash into us. Why so good? So, what do you think of this game, guys? Are you enjoying it? Are you planning to buy it? Are you not keen on testing out this game at all? I think it's great. I think it's marvelous. And the new update really, really helped this game out a lot. It's running a lot smoother, even though it's maxed out now, as you can see. Whereas I had it on medium settings before this update, so we did a lot of improvement. So here we have the different cameras. Let's watch the people disembark. Before we switch back to the main camera. Our cockpit view. Next right, stop. That's the external Vogue camera. Strasse. Beautiful. Let's take a nice little screenshot of this. Both front and back. Also, there should be a no HUD button where we can take some nice screenshots where everything disappears. Get some beautiful screenshots of this beautiful bus. Unfortunately, there's too much of a HUD as it stands, so... You know, time. All we need is some patience and time for the devs to get everything properly worked out and this game can be a blockbuster I'll tell you this can reach the lengths of uh, OMSI 2 and the bus easy well not the bus the bus I think is a class of its own so is OMSI by the way but it's such an old engine I think OMSI 3 should be coming out in the next two years 
And if it does, wow. It's gonna shake the house down. Very nice so far. Lots of trees. I don't think I can max it out any higher. Drive a bit from the external view. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hope I don't crash into any other one. Okay. You can scroll in and out. Very cool. You can hear the chirping of the birds. My bird is going to start chirping as well. I have a beautiful canary in the living room with me. So you probably heard it quite a few times in my uh, commentary videos. Uh, although I think my NVIDIA uh, broadcast does a good job of uh, filtering out. But let me know if you hear the bird in the videos. Really keen to know your thoughts. You can hear her voice all the way outside. That's a loud announcement. Next stop, Ein oder Straße. Ein oder Straße. So I can't see if anybody's coming unless I do this. Let's try and pull out without getting in. Smash! No, that was close. Buddy, there's a whole bus trying to make it out. You could break a little earlier. How about that? Alright, let's get back in to our safe zone. I feel much more secure from this camera view. Beautiful sky. Look at the clouds reflecting the sun. Very nice background. Almost looks like a painting. And the dog draw distance is very good now as well. You can see as far as the eye can see. Hello. 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 Hello, sir. Ease out as much as possible. Let the traffic go. And merge in nice and slow. No rush. No mistakes. Let's see if we can get another perfect gold run. And I think I reached level uh, 25 in the online... online list of top drivers yeah i think i'm level 25 hopefully i'm gonna go higher i like how it falls back because of the uh the downhill just rolls back just ever so slightly pretty good physics on the bumps as well i'm not feeling them though i'm not feeling the shocks whoa let's slow down jim you're going a little too fast It's a dangerous pull here, gotta be careful. Let all the cars pass before we turn. And this is our chance. Oh, I think I hit it. For them to shoot, yeah, I crashed the bus. Onto the pole, so you heard everybody scream. I think that's my first mistake, guys. But, you know Jimmy Dali. You can't go wrong with him crashing. He's always going to have a crash somewhere. Whether it's American truck or Euro truck. Always going to crash. Unlike his son Val. Who never crashes into anything. Such a pro driver. 
such a talented, talented, skilled truck driver, racing, whatever the case may be. Taught him how to drive on a racing wheel from the age of two and a half, I think. Yeah, I think it was two and a half years old. I got a video on that as well. He was playing uh, Need for Speed back then. Got his little gold curls on his head. Wearing a diaper. It was a fun video. It's still on my channel if you guys find it. Hit it up with a comment, a like. You guys are really going to enjoy it. Now, does he crash? Well, I'll let you find out. I think this might be our last stop. Looks like it. So, all right, so we got to do a quick right and then a quick left, a uh, quick left and then a quick right turn signal, just to make sure we don't get our second mistake. I didn't get a bonus for it. Huh, weird. All right, last stop. What, what's going on? Am I not parked correctly? Oh. Right. Okay, let's back up. Back up. Back up. Let's get on the right part. Alright. Try this again. How about that? Hang on. Uh, hello, game. My doors aren't opening up. Did I come in from the wrong angle? I think I have to turn it around. <laughs> oh, this is going to be too funny. I think I came in from the wrong angle, guys. So let me quickly just turn this bus around. I don't know how I'm going to do that, though. Probably go here. It says turn right. What a way to end the video. <laughs> this is horrible. Right, let's see if this is the correct way. That's what it shows me on the map, so I'm going to follow the map as much as possible. But, I don't know if they're going to disembark. I think I was the right way before. Oh, no, this is it. This was it. This was awkward, I'll tell you. I've never parked, never parked in my life on the left-hand side of the platform. That was weird. All right, so here we are, level 27, and we got gold. Two mistakes, one stop sign, and I didn't even re realize this. And non-traffic hits, that, that was the pole we hit. So ride quality 100%, they're pretty happy. 21 passengers, and this was the electric bus, guys, that just came out on the new 1.1 uh, update. So check it out. It's on right now. It's live on Steam. Uh, this is Bus Driving Simulator 22. Check it out. If you haven't gotten this game already, pick it up. I think it's well, well worth its money. Now on early access, it's very cheap for the price and what you're getting as a game as a whole. I think it still has a lot of things to be uh, fixed. A lot of uh, optimization still, but... With this new update, it looks very promising. Thank you, Ovalex. You get you guys did an amazing job so far. You're listening to the community, and you guys are awesome. Stay awesome, guys. So this is Jimmy Dali signing out. Don't forget, share, like, favorite, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, all.